My name is Jasmine Burton and I'm originally from Atlanta, Georgia. Uh, I'm passionate about toilets, which is kind of a strange thing, uh, but I learned when I was a freshman at Georgia Tech that nearly half the world doesn't have access to uh, hygienic sanitation and that disproportionately hinders the livelihoods of women and girls. According to the World Health Organization, 68% of the world's population have only minimum access to basic sanitation. Jasmine Burton decided she could do something to help solve this global sanitation problem. Three years later, Wish for Wash was born. Wish for Wash came out of a Georgia Tech senior design project. Uh, it was an interdisciplinary uh, class where designers and engineers worked together uh, to create a product. And for us, it was this opportunity to create a modular toilet for a refugee camp in northern Kenya called Kakama. Uh, and from there, we were invited to participate in the Georgia Tech Adventure Prize competition, which is the largest undergraduate invention competition in the U.S. Uh, we won. The team's toilet is called Safi Chu, or Clean Toilet, in Swahili. What I think is novel about it is the fact that it is modular, so it is a sit toilet. Uh, it can be used as a squat toilet. It can be used as a compost toilet, so it's self-contained or it can have a component on the inside that makes it into a pore flush unit so you can you know pour your own amount of water if you don't have access to, to running water so the idea is it can be modular um, and it can kind of meet the needs of the community based on where they are the company attracted the help of Tanvi Suresh who designs consumer oriented products and is training volunteer students how to conduct research and development being an engineer um, so you need to actually understand like what the person wants, that's our whole human design center thinking. And that's also engaging different people of all ages and different skills and understanding um, sanitation, something that they might not have thought a lot about in their prior experiences. This $50 portable toilet is made from durable plastic material and has been tested in Zambia for over a year. Safi Chu is also being used by refugee farmer communities around the Atlanta region. In some of these farming communities or gardening communities, there's kind of more remote. So, you know, people will have to walk, you know, 10, 15 minutes beyond kind of their farming area to go to the restroom, which encourages people to, you know, go to the bathroom in the woods, which, you know, leads to health problems if you're actually, you know, gardening or farming there. And so it's like, if you have something that's you know, available on the property the community has expressed interest in, and so that's what we were helping. The group raises money and awareness through merchandise and coloring books for children, available on the Wish for Wash website. From Atlanta, Georgia, Ariadna Budianto, VOA News.